Morning, everyone, or afternoon, officially. Hello. Um, we're we're a little bit disappointed this morning. We just made a small diversion from our hotel to go to uh, Bell End, <laughs> way to Glasgow, because we're essentially twelve. But there's no sign, so you just have to take our word for it that we are currently sat at the traffic lights in Bell End. So now we're going to go and find breakfast. We were hoping to have a Bell End breakfast, but there's nowhere close. I but mean, to be fair, it's always a Bell End breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> Smith and Brewer late breakfast review. We're still in uh, West Midland. Wol Wolverhampton. We went to uh, Sainsbury's Cafe for breakfast. We both had the uh, the big loomy breakfast. It was a solid, reliable three guitars out of five. Well, it loses one. For... <laughs> it loses one for the fact that it took them forever to make it and bring it to us. I think they were, I don't know, trying to squeeze the eggs out the chickens or anyway we're on our way to Glasgow now finally so we should be out rocking Glasgow nightlife by about eight o'clock you don't know who knows we might even go to an open mic night because <laughs> you know what else are we gonna do we're live from the beautiful surroundings of um look look where we are there's like Scotland there's Clouds on the mountains, sun's coming through the clouds. And we've been sat here for about 20 minutes because there's an accident up ahead that's blocked the road. Yeah. So we're on our way to Inverness though. But you know what it's time for? Da, 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 da. The Smith and Brewer breakfast review. This morning's breakfast was taken at uh, the MS Food Hall just outside Perth. I had scrambled eggs on toast, they were excellent. <laughs> Jimmy had a jacket potato. I did. Cheesily the best jacket potato you've had on this trip. So far, yeah. I mean, it, to be fair, it's the only one. But... Um, so, yeah. Oh, I dropped my phone. <clears throat> so, there we go. Here we are. Last night we were in Glasgow. We um, we played at an open mic night. We did. After a few drinks. So, that was interesting. Glasgow was cool. Glasgow was cool. Although, I did have a disappointing kebab. It's not a vibrator. I'm talking to you from the stage of Eden Court in Inverness. So yeah, this is it. This is the stage. It's all 10 cc's gear. Aston microphone. Thanks, Aston. Sounds lovely in here as well. It's wicked. Look at that. Stunning. Massive backstage area. Look at this. Again, it was more of a brunch, I think. Asda Cafe. Pretty good. Omelette and I mean, chips, I mean... What's, what's not to like, really? Surprisingly filly. Yeah, very much so. Uh, um, magical expanding expanding foam omelette. Yeah. But perfectly all right. Yeah, yeah, it was good. Great view from the cafe. Yeah, it was beautiful. You could see mountains and trees and stuff. Great night last night in Inverness. It's a good one. Uh, we had a new sales record. Console. Console hall this evening. We're about to drive through the wilderness. The Cairngorms? Yeah. It's 
Ferd's birthday. Happy birthday, Ferd. It is. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Ferd. Happy birthday to you. There we go. Mm. Happy birthday, Ferd. It's also the birthday of Owen Fleetwood Jenkins today. Should we sing so, happy birthday too? Mm. I mean, we, we, we can. Yeah, shall we? Yeah. yeah. Happy birthday to you. And many more. That's it. Okay, so happy birthday, everybody. <laughs> and happy birthday to us. Uh, and we'll see you there. All right. Toodaloo. Say bye. Bye. <laughs> awesome. We're here for the, the lunchtime review with special guests. Hiya! Okay, look. It's going to be a bit windy now, so I'll turn it around. But there's Edinburgh Castle. It's, um, it's a bit blowy, yeah. but it's nice. There's a big drop over here. It's for my mum. Look yeah. at this. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Heebie jeebies. Tonight we're playing Usher Hall, which is yeah. a beauty. It's a big one. Absolute beauty. We're going to see if we can persuade them to let us use the massive organ at the back of the stage. <laughs> Yes. Or for some of our slower numbers. Yep. <laughs> da, 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 da. <laughs> but yeah, so there we go. This yeah. is Edinburgh. Yeah. This is a beautiful theatre. Hang on. It is. I think my drum Martin chord. Oh, mystical, mystical. As a company, we used to do John Martin. Did you? Yeah. Look at this. This is Usher Hall we ran out in of Edinburgh. Yeah, I saw him on, on that Beautiful song. city, beautiful theatre. As we're here. Ah, we're locked. Can't get in. Oh, I think Ben's got the key. Never mind. Okay, we're, we're mixing it up this morning. We're going to do an actual live breakfast review. We had a lovely time in Edinburgh last night. Then we had a wonderful, wonderful, very dark cross-country drive to Carlisle. And here we are at the, the beautiful M6 Carlisle services, having spent a night in the uh, M6 Carlisle Travel Lodge. I've got a sausage sandwich from the uh, services next door. Let's see how it is. Jimmy's got... Fruit salad. Fruit salad. And... Smoothie. <clears throat> Trying to, trying to get an M&S endorsement deal. Yeah. So I'm, I'm going to try my sausage sandwich. I'll do it off screen because no one wants to watch me eat. Mmm. <laughs> Any good? It's fine. The coffee is <clears throat> not dreadful, actually. The coffee's all right. Yeah. It's nice in the Starbucks. Absolutely. Oh, yeah, anything's nicer than... Jimmy's beginning to turn S me into... Bucks. Yeah, Spucks. Jimmy's beginning to turn me into a coffee snob. Yeah, I mean, as much as he told me that Starbucks coffee tastes like burnt toast, and, and now and it really does. Good. Um, disclaimer, these opinions are our own, not those held by the broadcaster. But, um, you know, we got 20% off with our Travelodge key fob. Yeah. <laughs> win win. So this is it, kids. Glamour. We're following the um, rule one of the Ralph McTell touring rule book, <laughs> which is eat when you can. Yeah. Um, sleep when you can. Sleep when you can. And um, find the spoons. Yeah. But anyway, we're, uh, we're going to eat this, then we're going to get a real. It's going to be really good. <laughs> we're really excited. Yeah. Um, we're really not going to get bored of that pun very quickly. We're really not. So is today Roadie Friday? Is that today? Is that tomorrow? Today is Roadie Friday. So we learnt no... a new phrase, Roadie Friday, which is when you've got a, a day off the next day, but it could be any day of the week. Mm. So what, I don't even know what day of the week it is. What it's is Thursday. It? So Thursday. tomorrow's actually Friday. It's going to be Friday, Friday. Roadie Friday, Friday. But today's Roadie Friday because it's the last day of work. It's true. We're going to have two Fridays in a row. It's going to be like crossing the international date line. Roadie Friday and then Friday, Friday. We're crossing so... the international roadie date line. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's my nephew's birthday today. Mm. It's... Uh, William Brewer's birthday. All right. Um, I'm not trying to finish my sausage. 
Hold on. Yeah. The Charlie Watts of the Brewer family. <laughs> Go on then, you kick it off. Okay. I'll join in. Many more. Bye bye, everyone. Also, these sausages really are quite good. So yeah, so if you if you ever buy Carlisle, fancy a sausage baguette, pop in the services.